Welcome to another guide for Metroid Dread. My name is Oso, and today we'll be discussing how to get Early Screw Attack. This guide is intended for those who have already completed Early Space Jump. If you don't already know how to do that, please click the link for my tutorial here. With that out of the way, let's get started. From Space Jump, you'll need to make your way back down to Arteria. The fastest way you've found so far is to take the elevator down to Dayron and locate the yellow teleportal back to Arteria. There, you will make your way towards the lower left beyond the frozen sections to get to the room where Screw Attack is held. You will need to perform an underwater bomb jump. The setup is to morph ball on the ground and place a bomb. Allow Samus to bounce on the bomb and unmorph before reaching the ground. This will allow you to bounce mid-water. Jump along the wall to the left and quickly morph into a ball. Lay a bomb at the apex of the jump and unmorph while landing. Quickly jump and morph again to position Samus right as the bomb explodes. Wait until she's near the ledge to unmorph again. Note that Samus only gains height while still in morph ball. When done correctly, Samus will grab onto the ledge above her. Once you are on the ledge, you will need to space jump skip across the water to the ledge on the right. Samus will be jumping in and out of the water, so do not jump too early, or you will fall and need to restart. Space Jump Without Gravity Suit allows you to maintain the same height within water. A unique interaction occurs between Space Jump and ceilings that pushes you further than intended. You want to aim Samus so that at the bottom of her jump, she is barely underneath the corner of the rock outcropping to the right, and then jump while pulling left to not hit your head on the ceiling. When done correctly, you'll gain a small amount of height in your jump. At a minimum, you'll need to do this twice to get out of the water. Once out of the water, head towards the statue for screw attack. Now that we have screw attack, you need a way out of the room. Jump through the ceiling blocks and flash shift to the left, careful to not engage the rotating platform. Run left to the door that is sealed. Now, begin a speed boost. You'll have just enough time to charge a shine spark before the rotating platform drops you. Quickly move left through the water and shine spark up the shaft. Make your way back down to the left and return to the ledge where you first performed the space jump water skip. Perform the water skip again and pass through the first door to your right. Destroy the bone block with a charge shot. Return to the first door and screw attack the ceiling above. Pass through the next two doors on your right and space jump up the diagonal shafts. Stick closer to the top rather than try to stay in the middle. When you reach the red teleportal, you've escaped with a screw attack. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a like. Also, subscribe to my channel for more guides like this one. My name is Oso, and thanks for watching.